Hello everyone and welcome to France 1914. Now uh, this together with uh, East Prussia 1914 kind of completes the opening moves of the First World War. And the uh, main campaign for France 1914 is the race to the sea scenario with 246 turns and it's just about the uh, Allied armies trying to outflank the Germans and the Germans trying to outflank the Allies. And um, yeah, and then, and, and then in the end it just becomes a stalemate and uh, and they start setting up trenches. Uh, it also does a little bit of the um, first battle of yeah this town. Now I forgot to pronounce it, but Belgium or Northern France. I think it's Northern France. I, I know the British called it Wipers, so because they couldn't pronounce it either, so I just call it uh, Wipers, just like them. There you go. It's 54 turns, but there's some longer versions of it. And that's kind of a secondary scenario. Uh, I think this is mainly the British side. Uh, I think, so. yeah. And then there's more smaller, smaller scenarios, which just cover certain aspects of the battle. And then there's all small, uh, all sorts of other battles that uh, happened in 1914, but weren't uh, as big. And I uh, will be playing a small scenario. We're going to be doing um, Mons now. Mons, I'm pretty sure, is the first, yeah, the first um, time that the British fought against the Germans in the First World War. And I'll just uh, read it. I'm pretty sure it's pronounced uh, Bonds, um, Mons. Sorry, uh, but I could be wrong. But anyway, so Belgium, uh, the 23rd of August 1914, with the outbreak of war in 1914, the Germans advanced uh, through Belgium. Belgium almost completely unopposed by any real threat. Von Kluck's uh, first army quickly approached a small uh, Belgian town of Munz, or Munz, uh, I'm not sure, yeah, I can't pronounce it, which was a place that had seen the passage of British armies of bygone days, many town names in the area having, having long been etched upon British regimental colours. The British Expeditionary Force had only just arrived in the area after a long march to set up hasty defence Defense, isn't that many hasty defense position? Now, I appreciate it's maybe defensive positions along Von Kluck's path. We have orders to, uh, to hold out the flank of the Allied armies. The clash that followed was become uh, Britain's first major battle of the Great War, and a shock to the Imperial German Army. The German High Command was convinced that their massive army would sweep the tiny British Expeditionary Force into the sea in a matter of weeks, but at Munz. Uh, the the contemptible little army made their stand and quickly dispelled those illusions. So it's only a medium size. It's one step up from last time, and uh, we're gonna get into it. So we played as the Germans last time, so we'll play as the Allies this time. And here we are. And it's once. Uh, oh, just we'll just let the Germans do the opening moves. They're in trouble mode mainly. Yeah, and this is the whole. British Expeditionary Force right now. Is that our turn? Good. Okay, I think it is. So, um, now if I do Shift, it gives us all the names of the places. Now if I press Shift Alt, they will stay there. Oh, okay, no. The Germans still were moving, okay. Oh, some units are going to be withdrawing. Air units are, we do have air power. Okay, so we've got 14 turns. So now this is Nim Nimi. Which is the this hold, held by the uh, fourth fourth company of the Royal Fusiliers? Because yeah, of the Ninth Infantry Brigade of the Third Infantry Division of the Second Corps of the British Expeditionary Force, with some machine, backed up by machine gunners, Sec Second Royal Armoured Machine Gun Battalion, Fourth Middlesex. Uh, no, these are battalion size. Sorry, yeah. So there's Fourth Middlesex Battalion. I'm pretty sure that's that's what's saying. They all go, oh, they actually got over a thousand men, yeah. And we've got more machine guns. So um, that's our front line. Well, with the the bit bit at the front where the first contact with the German troops are made, we do see some more cavalry coming down here. And we do have the fifth cyclist coin. Now I believe, if I remember correctly, this this unit suffered the first casualties of the British during the First World War. They they suffered the first. Um, and then we have some Hussars, and are these actually, no, they are fixed, can we just turn on fixed units? Oh wow, okay, so everything is fixed, apart from these three, or these units at the front. We've got some French over here holding obsolete uh, forts, 
And the, oh, so the ninth, nineteenth brigade will withdraw for whatever reason. So and the first corps will withdraw, probably finding Germans down here somewhere. But that okay. So that's yeah. That's it's gonna be something because all our units are fixed. So the first turn is gonna be a little bit boring because <laughs> we only have these units. So hopefully they get unfixed. Let me just check when. I don't know, yeah, we're not getting any reinforcements. It's currently 6 a.m. 6 on the 23rd of August. When you get released. So, okay, right now these units are just being released. The, oh no, maybe at the start of next turn. These French units. Um, and then the machine gun uh, is already released for some reason, maybe because it's seen the enemy. It was meant to be released at 8 a.m. And then we've got the Suc uh, Suffolk uh, units just here. Probably move them up to the front. And then the first cavalry brigade down by this town. You, you guys can read it. I can't pronounce it. And then the fifteenth uh, and the second Royal Irish fifth cavalry brigade, which I can't see uh, over here. And then the hussars and the cyclist koi. Again, I don't understand because it's already it's this unit, isn't it? Oh no, it's this one. No, that's the fifth cyclist company. Sorry. And then the whole unit is uh, then unfixed. Okay. So that's that. Uh, and here's Mons with a thousand victory points. Let me just check the victory score. So uh, this, it's it's um, set up for the central powers. So it's a central powers major defeat, which means an allied major victory. So I just have to keep their score under 2,500 and then we will score a major victory. Um, okay, so since we can't do that much, we're going to take you out of travel mode. Get out. We've got this by a fifth uh, cyclist company. And where to put them? Uh, got some, yeah, my, there's a lot of marches here. Marshes here. Uh, yeah, you've already seen. I think you should just probably move back, really. Oh, no. Oh, I didn't mean I didn't mean to press N turn. Sorry. Uh, I need to move you. Yeah, I'm gonna actually move you this way just to see if there's any Germans coming down the flank. I probably should have left you in trouble mode right actually if I was gonna do that. But anyway, I want you in combat just so you don't get ambushed or anything. And then we have you these units. Uh. Yeah. Okay. So we're gonna fire on the cavalry. 60 men. No far back. Cover three. No, they can't compete with the firepower of our unit. A thousand men firing on uh, probably 300. And they got disrupted. Um, I'm going to machine gun. Oh, no, disruption, good. Yeah. They can't fire back because it's out of range for them. Uh, these guys can't fire, but the machine gun can, so we're machine gun these troops. No disruption. And that's going to be it, because we only have five units to move. Yep. Uh, we see the cavalry brigade that's still in travel mode. Won't get to the front for probably another turn. And yeah, well that's... Oh, no, we have air power. I forgot about that. We have the third airplane squadron... With three recon planes as a third of the Royal Flying Corps. So we can actually just have a quick scout over here. Let's just use it here there. We see HQ. Don't know which one is, but no units along this road. So they're coming down this way. Which is good. Uh, I want to find out though what's attacking the French. If something's going to be taking the French forts. Yeah. And, but anyway, uh, we'll have a end our turn. Court Mons. Oh, uh, Mons. Oh, yes. That's, that's, that's the, uh, there's two, ba by the way, there's two scenarios of Mons. There's a bigger one, which I tried, but it was way too big. For me. Uh, but anyway. And, ooh. Again, more fog of war, I guess. I can't see what they're doing, but there is a large, large uh, stack of men here. Three battalions, and they're getting close as well. These broke. These oh, they've some disruptions. 
Oh, they got disrupted though. Okay, so we've got the second world RSMG has been released. First guards, we get more air units are available. And more units are coming from fatigue. Which is good, okay. Uh, what am I gonna do? Uh, there's quite a few units around here. I actually wanna see how many units are coming down this road. Ooh. That's completely unknown. We don't know where that is. But we know there's some units going this way. Yeah, more. So there's quite a lot. I would say that that's looking like that's looking like at least a brigade's worth. Probably, uh, probably be split of a division. Oh, we know we can. We know. So this is the sixth infantry division and the eighteenth infantry division right now. We, we're facing. Uh, also, while we can, we're gonna fire on the bigger stack. One hundred and one men. Five hundred. 105 men, getting fired back on, only at least one, and 96 in, power of the defense, yeah, uh, are we, yeah, we're in improved, uh, improved defenses, plus it's a city, or a town, so it really helps our defense, and they're going to take massive casualties, because they're out, staying in the middle of a road, oh, and one, one year just broke, there we go. Must the the eighteenth infantry then must not be a that that good of a unit. Either that or they just suffered massive casualties. But these guys aren't gonna be assaulting for a while. Uh yeah, this is this is yeah, a little bit worrying because the unit's completely the city's open. But they should run into our Highlanders, the Gordon Highlanders. Yeah. Um, okay, but get the machine gun. Probably machine gun the bigger unit still. Seven. Seven. Another, ah, oh, 20 men lost. Uh, we see that unit. Just, but let's continue moving this way. Oh, and just as I said. Hard twice. There's some units in there. I will stay around. Hmm. The French are just gonna stay there. They're still fixed, aren't they? Yeah. Uh, fixed, fixed, fixed. Ooh, but this the this unit isn't. Can you fire on the massive stack? Yeah. They lost quite a few men. And then we'll machine gun this unit. Oh, let's have some engineers. Oh, come on. Yeah, it see, also seems that the st standard units is morale C. The Highlanders are better with the morale B. Do we have any morale A troops? Uh, we didn't we have like a guard battalion somewhere? Ah, uh, well, no, these are morale B. These are pretty good. First King's Rifles. That's that's heavy artillery. I should have checked if we had... A, yeah, we do have artillery dialogue. Ah, completely forgot about it. Let's just bombard the road. Uh, hopefully, um, something, some unit will end up on that hex. Hopefully. Uh, and then what am I... Well, where's the guards? I swear we had guards somewhere. Actually, there's some two fixed units. Yeah, so these two, because they said the enemy can fire. Oh, and these guys can as well. Yeah. Uh, yeah, well, I give up looking for the guards. Everything else is fixed, so these guys can still fire. Let's turn off fixed. Gun, battery, fire on the... Oh, you in travel mode. Should be pretty uh, heavy losses for them. Almost 100 men lost, and that's going to be our turn, because the machine guns can't reach. It's only two hexes away. And they, yeah, they just can't reach, so we just end that turn. Oh, and I, I'm not sure if, oh no, I did use air power. Yes, that's how I knew that those guys were there. Okay, wow, they just lost uh, 180 men. And there's another vision here, because you can tell by the unit, co uh, unit colors. Ah oh, damn! I should have bomb. Uh, 
Yeah, nothing's gonna be there. Rip. That's gonna be a little bit sad. What did I put there? Yeah, the artillery's not gonna hit anything. Uh, we're gonna place the next one there. And I'm all used to smoothing around the fog of war that we can't see, so just waiting for that to happen. It's the 13th and 14th, more units moving up. 20 men lost. They're going to encircle that those units if I don't pull back. Uh... I need to pull back to Mons as well. I don't. I don't. Want, yeah, missed everything. Yeah, oh, I don't. That was a little bit sad. Okay, I need to change you. Gonna move you in front of that because that they're gonna be still there. Uh, our, our recon should be back. Just wanna have a quick look out how how many planes are coming over. Yeah. Okay, okay, the fix still. Uh, this is gonna be a little bit sad. Need to hold this because um, the flank, they're coming from this flank, but we've got nothing holding there. They can still move there and cut them off. Oh, actually, no, because it works, the supply can go through that way. But if they move there, then, then they're cut off. The, all three of these units are cut off. That's going to be really bad. And all our units are still fixed. Yep. It's going to really suck. Oh, and I feel, uh, I need it. Let's just recon a little bit more. Oh, yeah. This, I got disrupted. There's units going up and down this road. Uh, the bicycle company. Let's have a quick look. Oh, wow. Okay. Yep. And that's there's a divisional HQ as well, the Fifth Infantry Division, and yeah, there's another bit of it. So, okay, let's grab all you, shoot in front of you. Now you got disrupted. They won't be assaulting anytime soon. There's a hundred men lost, and we took four in turn. Wow, 218 men. That's probably the max. That's probably the most amount. Of oh, actually, no. I've gotten more with uh, howitzer shots. But in terms of wow, I had two units just broke there. And that's why you do not. Uh, uh, I probably want to re re uh, re forecast my re forecast. No, re plot my artillery then. Jeez, they they just took so much damage. Then we got these guys. Yeah, the artillery play actually they probably deserve the artillery more. Let's just put it here. Uh they're on low ammo, so I probably won't use them. Not sure if that's good wisdom or not, but we're just machining on the stronger units. Yep, we're gonna get fired upon by a lot. Oh, uh, and we've been disrupted. That's that's a little bit bad. The morale is falling. Go for one more machine gun attack. Now I've got another disruption. Good. This makes it a little bit that little bit harder for the Germans. Uh, you can do machine gunning them. Seventeen. Twenty-one. And twenty. And now we're going to just unleash into this cavalry units. Yeah, they've already been disrupted. Uh, can you throw on... You probably won't. Oh, no, you can. Jeez, that's good. Oh, and then I'll actually use you on this stack. Yeah, that's probably... should have fired on that one more. And then we just use the riflemen to fire on the cavalry. And that's another six men gone. Okay. Now we have these, the 17th Infantry Division. So there's at least a good core attacking us. Uh, let's just machine gun you. No good disruption. 
Uh, let's just fire you. I probably should move my men. Move some men here. Because that's it's easy easily assaultable. Yeah. Oh, gonna fire again. That's they lost over well over a hundred men. But they're not disrupted, so I'm gonna move the Highlanders back in here. Just so um these units have some infantry to protect them. I know I am leaving this gap even wider, but uh, hopefully the Germans won't advance that far in. Because I could outflank them, but I mean, they're probably going to have so many units anyway. It's going to just need to inflict the maximum amount of casualties that I can. Let's go to quickly have a look at victory now. So we lost 66 men, which is 5 VPs for the enemy. They've lost 2,220 and uh, 2,258 men, which is 142 to us. So they've actually got negative score, which is good. We can continue on, and we can see more reinforcements right in front of our bicycle company. Oh, they got both just got disrupted. Wow, this is running into uh, that. Perfect. Yeah, they're reinforcing. They're getting close to Mons. Oh, and they cut it. Oh, and here comes the more attacks. This is another division. Yeah, there's its HQ. There's another division there. The French haven't been attacked yet. Yeah. It'll take a lot of movement, but it's technically possible to go uh, along here. It's just all the marshes are going to be problematic. Oh, we blew up the bridge, I think. That's going to be good. That's going to slow them down more. Yeah, the bicycle company needs to retreat. Wow. They just lost quite a bit of them in there. Oh, they did assault my bicycle company, but they were able to get away. They need to run away as well. So many units. Uh, no disruption. And finish up on my guns. 21. We've got the first guys we get somewhere, but they're gonna go. We've got more air units, but this place to recon. Yep. I like to have a look at where these guys are going actually. No, not not on that hex. Just like there. Just wanna see the flank, yeah. They're going to go into the city. Uh I want what I really want is to set up the machine gun here, but I won't have the time to do that. I, uh, yeah, look, I'm going to move my men, just... Oh, I have to be in trouble mode to cross the bridge, yeah, I forgot about that rule. Uh, okay. Uh, which means, I, which means that the, um, Germans won't be able to cross, is it? There's no bridge here, right? It's a canal, yeah. I think you need to be use a bridge to cross a good canal, so that's good. These units are all disrupted. You're gonna get fired upon. 145 men plus an disruption with three casualties. Oh, actually, no, a little bit more than three now. Four casualties in return. 153 and 145, uh, and they're all disrupted. They're gonna take. They're gonna take huge casualties. They were disrupted as well. Got more men moving in though. Are these okay? Let's just check what's fixed and what's not. Okay, all our units that aren't in the combat basically are fixed. Uh, yep. Looking, yeah, that's that's about right. There's no units down here. No, okay. Oh, don't want to go in 3D view. So you, okay. Machine guns can still reach these units. No, they can't. They... I mean, it is more casualties, but the uh, fatigue will build up. Oh, and plus they're disrupted, so... Uh, it's going to just annoy them. 
Uh, I'm not sure why they're there, but they are. And this machine gun, you. Oh, come on. Seventy-three. Jeez, they're taking pretty big casualties as well. But they are firing back because they're not fatigued. Come on, get them. And what infantry is the blue? You are the eighth infantry division, and more. Yeah, this is the fifth still. A bit of the sixth is spilling over. Because they're up here as well. With the 18th. Uh, okay, you need to run away. Let's try and move down. This bicycle company needs to get out of there. Uh, yep, and that's going to be it for the left flank. Let's just unload into this one battalion. Another 15 and disruption. Good. They won't be assaulting anytime soon. Okay, now grab you two, shoot at this unit. Oh, good. Disruption. And they're going to be sitting there for a little while. We're firing disruption. Now, oh, I could have gone for the assaults. I'll, I'll do it next turn. Yeah, because they're both disrupted now. Oh, and so are these guys actually. But I think I was continue just firing on them. Now they got a broken unit. Oh, wait, I'm gonna fire again. Fire once more. 35 and grab them and shoot into the crowd 85 men lost for any, for 85 for one man jeez the Germans are really getting it and then another broken unit and 42 men lost jeez okay now let's get this one unit that's just in here by itself. Come on. And they're still there. Now, uh, yeah, these guys are low ammo, so just gonna leave them as is, except for these machine guns, they can hit them. Okay, now I'm going to plot my artillery. What, what do I have available? I've got two. And I've got a howitzer. Which is over here, but it's not going to... Yeah, I only hit that unit, which is not that useful at the moment. Um, I'm praying that they don't move, but they probably will. So I'm just going to... Hopefully luck that they don't move. And let's go to the next turn. So they continue chasing my bicycle company in the marshes, slowing them down at least. Breaking the answer retreating. And uh have some time to rest. Yeah. They're moving after us. Ooh, and there's a lot of artillery there. Bit of fog of war movement now. Yeah, even more reinforcements coming down the main road. Should probably be on there. Now the shooting begins. One man, yeah, there is. Uh, the low ammo of our units is not helping. We could have done more casualties. Or well, they have assaulted my cavalry unit, but they were treated. 23, uh, 22, 26, 21. Yeah, the units aren't hitting that much. They're really tired and fatigued. 
really good defensive positions. No one be attacking. Wow, we're just taking like two losses. Let's do it. Over eighty. Oh, the morale, the morale is fallen. I got another disruption. 